gritty urban saga. So Google has recently purchased a company called Boston Dynamics, uh, which has shot them to the top of my theoretical Cyberdyne list, um, which is a, a list that I keep mentally about which companies are most likely to become the Cyberdyne of um, Terminator lore. Now, not that they weren't already there. They, they were already number one before this, but Boston Dynamics creates robots. Um, these robots, uh, I watched a few weeks ago uh, a couple videos on their robots that they make, and a few of them are very lifelike. Um, some of them are bipedal. Uh, they create humanoid-type movements. Uh, some of them are quadrupedal, and they create dog-like running, horse-like running, things like that. So basically they create robots that are, um, you know, very animal and human-like. Um, now that's not the scariest part about this. The scariest part about this is that Boston Dynamics currently has a contract with the U.S. military's Defense Advanced Research Projects Agency, which uh, is an acronym. Uh, it adds up to the acronym DARPA. So um, this is not theoretical. This is not something I'm making up. Um, Boston Dynamics has a contract with DARPA, and they've recently been purchased by Google. So, and and maybe this is a little far fetched of me, but they are uh, they're moving in the same direction as I would think a, a theoretical Cyberdyne would move. So from this point on, I'm going to call them uh, Google Dyne. Uh, Google Dyne. They're definitely moving in that direction. <laughs> um, so that puts the puts Google in the military contractor business, basically. Um, uh, temporarily, at least, while the contract is honored. Um, so the contract is still in effect. Um, and this is definitely something that I wanted to report on because uh, Terminator is my favorite movie. It's my favorite movie of all time. And I've always thought, well, at least up until recently, I've always thought that that idea was a little far-fetched and, uh, and that humans would see that sort of change coming. Uh, they, they would feel the, the change in the wind as we handed over um, simple tasks to robots and, and to artificial intelligence to run our daily lives. Um, and I always thought that you know people would be smart enough and corporations would be held accountable enough to not take it that far. But um, when a company as big as Google uh, purchases a company that... Uh, that does robotics of this sort and has military contracts and also Google recently announced their flying drones, their flying delivery drones that they're going to be rolling out here. I just can't help but to think that, you know, something like Terminator may be coming. So, so needless to say, I'm going to look up some people named uh, Sarah or John and uh, I'm going to get with them and find out what I need to stockpile. But anyway, thanks for your time here, guys. Gritty Urban Saga.